Hello, this is Johnny. Welcome to more awesome collection, uh, classic toys, uh, pop culture edition. Uh, this is for Lost in Space. Uh, we've got a nice uh, die-cast uh, B9 robot from Lost in Space by Johnny Lightning Company. And then by the Trendmasters, we have their big 12-inch uh, size uh, giant Cyclops figure. All furry. I'll uh, we'll take a look at him. Both of these. We'll take a look at the robot first. See, he can roll along a little bit. He's got some wheels in there. He's got a little bit of metal in him, and then the rest is plastic. See the Johnny Lightning logo there. And I can't quite make out the the year on there. These are from the 1990s sometime I got these. I think I still have some mint on the card, and then I had a, some loose. Austin Space, Robot B9. Uh, very cool. I don't want to bend his arms too much right now at all, but they do bend. And then he's just got the solid head. Nothing lights up or sound on it because it's a little, little guy. But it's got a little weight to it. It's got a some die cast to it and they made a the die cast chariot the space pod uh the jupiter 2 spacecraft and this but they weren't in scale with each other especially the robots a lot bigger than the scale for that but he looks good next to this because uh the cyclops on lost in space was very large I don't know if they got into a color episode. He was on an early episode uh, that they filmed. Black and white first season from 1965. Let's take a look at him. Limited edition. He came in a nice box. And then uh, see his foot. And he's by the Space Productions. And uh, by Treadmasters, Inc. Treadmasters made a lot of nice stuff. This is Tag. There we go, 1998 on this. I think the Johnny Lightning are earlier. They might be 93 or so. But he's nice, especially his, his hair moves all around. You make them wild because they had like space winds or so thing on there, so it went crazy like that on the on the video. And he go ah and menace menace them. Uh, let's take a closer look at the face. It's got a blue eye. I guess that's painted and not a decal. A very spooky uh, texture to his face. He's got some mean looking teeth. His claws. And he is bendable a little bit, but I got him in the pose basically I want him in. Uh, so very nice. I'll lean him back so you can see his face out of the shadows. But down there you can see how many uh, toes he's got. Uh, so a very neat action figure. I think those go for $40, $50 now. And they might have been in the 20 something to 30 29 range when they first came out. Very cool. They're not that rare, but they're also not that common, especially in, in the box. All righty, until next time, more uh, awesome toys, uh, classic toys. Uh, this is a subject from the 1960s, but this is from the 1990s when these were made for uh, pop culture classic, uh, Lost in Space from 65 to 68. Danger Will Robinson. Thanks for watching.